A former Travis County detective will spend the rest of his life in prison. Stephen Broderick pled guilty to capital murder today. He shot and killed his ex-wife, adopted daughter, and her boyfriend. Last year, KXN's Grace, uh, KXN, uh, KXN's Grace Reader tells us why their family says this is not justice. Today is not justice. No punishment will be justice, nor will it bring with it back. Family members of the three people shot and killed by former Travis County Detective Stephen Broderick addressed him for the first time Tuesday. Broderick pled guilty to capital murder. He'll spend the rest of his life in prison. How do you plead to the capital murder of multiple persons, guilty or not guilty? Yes. Broderick shot and killed Amanda Broderick, his ex-wife, Alyssa Broderick, his adopted daughter, and Alyssa's boyfriend, Willie Simmons III. I thought you being a policeman, I thought you being an academic I thought you would have some sort of honor. Police also arrested Stephen for sexual assault charges in 2020, according to court records. Family says he assaulted Alyssa. This plea did not address that charge, something family members of two of the victims protested prior to the hearing. We want him to be held accountable for those rapes. Just because she's dead and not here doesn't mean that it never happened. District Attorney Jose Garza sent a statement that said in part, We're grateful for our committed prosecutors who worked tirelessly to hold Mr. Broderick accountable and ensured that he will spend the rest of his life in prison and cause no more harm to our community. No one really wins. Alyssa's not coming home. Amanda's not coming home. Willie's not coming home. Grace Reader, KXAN News. And as part of this plea deal, Broderick waived his right to appeal. Had he gone to trial, he could have faced the death penalty with the capital murder charge.